Hey guys, WWE Fan Talks are here. Today I'm reviewing the WrestleMania 34 John Cena. This John Cena is supposed to be from WrestleMania 23, but it is in the WrestleMania 34, uh, I wouldn't say heritage line. Um, that's not even really a thing anymore. Uh, but here's the bio on the back if you want to read that. Then we have Cena, Brutus the Barber Beefcake, Randy Orton. That one I've been trying to find everywhere. I cannot find it. I really don't care to get the Kevin Owens. I mean, um, I have a Kevin Owens, but I'll get it anyways. I don't really care. And then, uh, yeah, that's all the guys in the set. Pretty good set. I just really wanted the John Cena and the Randy Orton. Picked up the John Cena. The Randy Orton is going for a lot currently online. And I can't find it at any of my stores. So I decided just to pick up the John Cena. All right, guys, let's get him cracked open. All right, so here is the John Cena out of the packaging. And I got to say, this is definitely one of the best John Cena elites that we have ever received. Uh, this is definitely one of my favorite attires. This is, I believe, the night where he fought Shawn Michaels for the WWE Championship. Uh, right there on the wristbands, we have some nice green like camo. We have some nice green right there. Let's get it focused. There we go. So now you can see like the designs. I don't really know what that is on there. Some sort of design on there that he wore that night. Um, I do believe that they were darker that night than what it is showing up on camera. I'm not really sure. Um, but I, I'm glad we got this John Cena figure uh, first because I'm kind of getting sick of the newer John Cena sculpts like the pants, and I'm kind of getting sick of like the, the upper torso, especially the arms. I don't know, it's just kind of getting annoying because every Cena figure seems to be the same to me. And it's nice to do a little like retro type thing, go back and use the old body sculpt and the old pants, old shoes, that kind of stuff. It's nice to get that again. Um, but then we got some nice green pants as well as, I think these are like, like his boxers showing up. It says respect right there. I think it's hustle, loyalty, respect, and it keeps going on this on the uh, other side. Pretty cool. And then just basic black belt, and then the knee pads right there, as well as these basic black shoes. And I do believe they're white that night with some black on them. I'm, I could be completely wrong. Uh, but yeah, very cool. He comes with a good amount of accessories. He comes with this hat right here. Very nice. Kind of like a lighter green than it really was. But that's okay. Very cool hat. And it also comes with this t-shirt, and we're going to slap it on in three, two, one. So here is the John Cena with the shirt on, and I gotta say, it's kind of a tight fit, which is good and bad, I guess you could say. Um, what I mean by tight is it was just kind of hard putting it on on the back. This Velcro is kind of hard putting it on. Uh, maybe it's just a little too small, I'm not sure. Um, but there is the design on the shirt right there, very awesome. I think it says, live fast and fight hard, something like that. Uh, an older t-shirt, but it's really cool that we're getting this, because... Uh, I, don't, I don't believe we ever got a Cena with this attire. Maybe in a basic series, I'm not very sure. Uh, but again, we do get the dog chains right here, as well as the hat. It looks pretty good on him. Um, so yeah, if you guys have been wanting a John Cena uh, that night at, from WrestleMania 23 when he fought Shawn Michaels for the WWE title, this is the perfect one to get. You can pick it up at Ringside Collectibles and use discount code TANNER, T-A-N-N-E-R, all caps, to save 10%. As well as you can get the rest of that WrestleMania 34 series there. Um, this did not come with it, but I wanted to see how it looked on the John Cena, especially because he, I believe, he retained the title that night. And I gotta say, it looks pretty awesome. Very awesome, like flashback retro look. Um, very cool. I really like that. Um, definitely one of my favorite John Cenas. Let's get him compared with uh, one of the newer Cenas. One that I'm comparing with the WrestleMania 34 is the Elite Series 50 John Cena with the red, white, and blue. It's pretty funny because John Cena is always pretty much represented America. Right here you have the American camera going on. And then we have red, white, and blue res, uh, representing America. Very awesome. But as you can see, guys, they are completely different figures. Um, they definitely changed the torso over here. I know they did a long time ago, but it, I'm just going to compare the two. Um, I'm not sure which out of the two torso sculpts I liked more. This one's a lot more shredded. This one's a lot more big. I, I wouldn't say it's a lot bigger, but... Um, I don't really know. It's definitely taller. And then his arms are bigger on this one. Um, I would say this is more of like a current looking Cena and this is more of an older looking Cena, uh, sculpt wise. And then definitely with the pants. He definitely wears shorter pants now. Um, definitely back then, uh, he had longer pants covering his knee pads and that kind of stuff. Um, it really be, would have been cool if they added more color on his shoes right here rather than just black. I like how they do that with the newer Cena figures with like the neon green. Uh, but that's pretty cool. Comment down below, guys, which Cena you like more or which style of the John Cena you like more. That's it for this video review, guys. I highly recommend you go to Ringside Collectibles and pick this John Cena figure up. It is super awesome, and I, I really like it a lot. Definitely one of my favorite John Cenas of all time. Another thing I forgot to point out is I forgot to uh, um, 
I forgot to point out that they forgot to paint the armband right there. I don't really know. I think he had an armband that night. I could be wrong, but I believe he did have one. So correct me if I'm wrong. But yeah, that's got that's it for this video review, guys. I highly recommend you, men. you go pick this up. Again, use that discount code Tanner, T-A-N-N-E-R, all caps, to save 10% at Ringside Collectibles. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.